this melanin holds something special, not just physically. Yeah, we can stand in the sun and be affected minimally, but I think it's time we have a conversation, critically, about all that we are capable of, a reminder that there is no limit to our ability. When society speaks to me, she not only mocks, but mimics me. In the same breath, the way she studies me, then takes notes and cheats on the test and still fails to pass. That speaks volumes louder than anything she's ever dare say to my face. Now, not to sound crass, but I have started to find my voice and you sure as hell will make me feel bad for taking up space. It's like I've spent years trying to fit in a box and detangle my locks instead of doing what I ought to. Remembering that my very essence is sacred and unique from the way that I turn heads when I walk into a room to my very aroma and physique. Now I'm not trying to preach, truth be told, about the love and the light that this darkness holds. If only we took the steps to watch the flower fully unfold, letting it blossom into something unfathomable and bold. The light shines on us like it shines from the soul. So, little black boys and girls that may look like me, please know that you will come across those that try to play with your psyche. Please also know that you are gorgeous beyond comparison indefinitely. And the limit to your success is indefinite. See, our beauty is not up for question, nor is it simply a trend. When the world tries to break us, we simply bend and snap right back. So let our spirits be filled with resilience and let our voices sing with resound. Let our melodic existence remain sweet. Just like the sound. So. You can buy all the culture you want. Go ahead and get the lip fillers and flaunt. But this majesty, this richness, this spice comes straight from the source, baby. Life imitates black, black imitates 